Hello, and welcome to this Hello ID provisioning product release video for January 2023. Hello ID provisioning is a 100% born in the cloud, easy to configure and maintain user provisioning solution. It helps organizations to fully automate the user lifecycle management in the network by connecting the HR or SIS as a source system. Every change in this source is detected and processed into the network. No more worries about stale user accounts, accumulation of licenses or access rights, manual user management or compliancy issues. Please note that in this video, we will only show the new functionality for the January 2023 release. Please go to docs.helloid.com or our YouTube channel for more videos. Let's get started. In this video, we'd like to start with a PowerPoint presentation and then demo the new functionalities for the January 2023 release. We have two new items in this release. First, remember filter on grids, like business rules. This feature is related to all of the grid components that are being used within the Hello ID provisioning module and will remember the configured filter conditions for future use. Our second item is the title department code in condition overview of business rules. With this feature, the UI of a business rule condition overview has been changed, which now also supports the title or department code that is being displayed in the condition overview. Let's start with a short demo of the new features in this release. Our first stop is the newly introduced persistent grid filters, as you can see, for example, in the business rules overview. You already had the filter overview here in which you could filter the grid of this business rule. Now, when we switch to this overview, it only shows the draft business rules. But see, when there is an active filter configuration, the filter icon turns blue which means that a filter for this grid is being applied on the page. This will continue to show when refreshing the grid or reopening the page. So, the persistent filter configuration is in place, and this will also work for all of the other grids that are available within Hello ID provisioning. Our next item in this release is the title and department code in condition overview. When we open a business rule, you can see that the departments and the titles are displayed based on the description. But when you navigate to the condition overview and open one of these, you can see the description, but now you can also see the code of the department or title because of this release. This is a very helpful addition when having multiple departments containing the same display name, but if they differ from each other based on the code, you can now see what the difference is. One small remark on this release is that after this version of Hello ID is released, the data stored in Elastic will be temporarily unavailable. This is because of the process of migrating the data. Thank you so much for watching. Please let us know if you have any additional questions. You can post your question in YouTube or send it to isupport at toolsforever.com. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive frequent updates about improvements and changes in Hello ID. Have a wonderful day.